Welcome to this Facebook live presence on sustainability science and education, especially on online teaching learning process. In this session, we are going to discuss about sustainability and sustainable development and the its international efforts and how the economic commitments especially on how to grab side and what are the infrastructure details available in the group and how we are going to use that online teaching and learning and how Igno provides fourth water uh, learning content under their approach details and what are student support services and the relevant uh, portal access and their login their friends uh, details we are going to dis uh, discuss about that and also like what are the certification process this modality like we are going to discuss in this purpose we have the expertise and the program coordinator dr kumar assistant professor from school of social sciences yeah, it's for interesting in the Yeah, interesting in the Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Thanks, sir. Now, sir, just uh, can you tell me, uh, like, tell us about what is sustainability sciences and how it's important for uh, our nations? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, see, uh, uh, as uh, an instructor, please say this slide one. Please uh, show this slide one. Uh, see, when we are talking about uh, sustainability, uh, I think so, uh, most of us know that this is not a new job. It is uh, already uh, That's to sustain the system. Sure. That if, if it is uh, looking into the and in a somewhat broad sense, you grant that your uh, financial, in your financial uh, data, uh, your home financial and uh, the calculation, how you have to plan in it, and uh, how much money has to be uh, invested in these different activities. So it's a bit so you go. We are publishing on features. Features, yeah, that is consistent. So what I want to say is the term sustainability, the concept sustainability and sustainability development is not new. Okay. But if you look into and uh, what is happening in the broader perspective of uh, higher, I mean, level to, of you know, global projects, so okay. macro level, we will have to understand uh, what are the industrial revolution of the industrial revolution. Especially in the last century, that is from the 60s onward, we realized that because of the industrialization, because of the activities we have uh, uh, taken place to have a I mean, uh, robust economic growth. And that was the world. Environmental degradation is happening. Mm -hmm. Because of that, we forget about nature society interaction. We never consider that. Oh. That means it's karma. Yeah. Right. Then uh, we have to uh, know about when we start from the frontier on human environment. Mm -hmm. right. That talks about how poverty, environment relation, degradation is happening. Then we are in our own business going on. This is how concerning the issues of your sustainability you are concerning everything in your day to day activities that can look into different scale that created the problem and now we realize that we have to do something for a sustainable plan. That is how we do. So when we talk about the issues of sustainable development, because we have a debate about sustainable uh, development debate across at different level across the world. The major focus is, you know, development is big because of our education, right? Yeah. Infrastructure is yeah. So, when
So typically, uh, we have the United Nations Convention on the Environment in 1992. That happened in 19, uh, uh, that arrived uh, uh, in Sanae in 1992. In that, we have agenda to ensure that from above and working together to bring the humanity at the government level across the world, that agenda 21 7 26 talks about education on a sustainable development. And then UNESCO, UN body, it was assigned, it was assigned to the task manager of the implementation of Agenda 21, that is sector 26. So uh, here, just I have a note. So you know it's already been made of situations. Like from you know, what are the courses I like uh, provided for the uh, national level or international level for sustainable sciences? Yeah. Uh, I was uh, from coming to uh, what is our you know, economics and you know regions, you know types of sustainable development education. I would like to uh, I mean uh, reflect upon I mean just what I want to bring on the issues of education for sustainable development of this problem. What is education for sustainable development? And education for sustainable development, you know. It's a learning process. If you look into the team vision measure or given by the UNESCO and so on, it is a learning process for a post to teach something okay. based on ideas and the principles that underlie sustainability. I told you, I mentioned you that sustainability, where a person is asked to be streamlined in the process. And it's also concerned with all levels. Now, we cannot teach sustainability into a I have to go to a particular community and into a particular area. Okay. All levels and types of learning to be provided to body education and foster sustainable human development. On how to do this, learning to know, learning to be, learning to live together, and learning to do, and learning to transform oneself and society. Okay. To that only we can achieve uh, sustainability in which today we are moving on not sustainable learning for Then we can look into uh depending upon the some of the few other tools uh which was proposed by the academic that have to stand alone in two efforts. One is employing perspective. Because when you have any issues, when you know about education, then certain groups. Who consider it need when society is important challenges when we are trying to do this now meeting and uh, that's depend on what I myself has to be. Uh, I mean, uh, have that capable kind of capability, or when you have a that uh, uh, way of critical thinking, that way of uh, way of uh, that understanding to convince the others, right? The another behavior modification in this type of perspective is to alter the learner's habit. As I told you, society is society that we need for, right? So their habits need to be either in line with most successful or less successful ideal to be clear for success. So the indigenous involvement are uh, parameters differ depending on the perspective, and we have to look into how can we have to change to education of the uh, behaviors for that we can bring it into uh, this uh, bring it into behavior and they will become a more sustainable uh, pathway. Right. So if you look into say the economy and when uh, about the internet making first, I have for all the mentioned about the United Nations case of the conference that in the economic conference that was that uh, convener, the British Liberation, that we call the British Liberation of the next coming summit, and summit, and uh, one of the major achievements of 1992 is, as I told you, about 
Ajit 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 Ignores commitment and ignores initiative for uh, uh, the development of the world. We establish the uh, CRS member of the world that take care of and that uh, introduce the university introduce a number of new programs to actually start sustainable development. Uh, what are those programs? What are those programs after the evening? I see, uh, we have a number of applications in programs, sustainable science. And different approaches we follow. Uh, we do different programs from ecosystem uh, perspective for our community. And we have a university program on demand and ecosystem. And uh, we had uh, that nutrition security, uh, 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 nutrition security, sustainable development. And uh, as the achievement we have uh, so far met in that time, now at the end of uh, the decade of, when they get of education to sustainable development. We are able to introduce sustainable uh, science uh, discipline in the form of program that is supposed to diploma in sustainability in science. Right? Yeah. So that is uh, what we are uh, having. So, uh, what I uh, want to uh, tell you uh, is that when we are talking about education for sustainable development, you know, uh, sustainable science is really important. Is actually in 1990, we stopped all contracts and set up to each one. Then we have Millennium Development Goals, then RIO plus 10, RIO plus 20. After RIO plus 20, we are implementing, certainly implementing sustainable development goals. Now we have to achieve a disease by 2030. So, uh, in this line, in terms of initiative, our commitment is very clear that we have to introduce in our program and uh, different models. If I uh, say uh, that uh, what kind of models uh, we follow when we are uh, going in, uh, implementing education for sustainable development, uh, some of, uh, based on two models uh, proposed by a few of Indian academics uh, as they are many in our class, one is the inclusion model. Okay. You know, it's, it's sustainable, sustainable development education, then diffusion model. When we talk about inclusion model, uh, the concept of sustainability science mm -hmm. that has to be infused is a different or separate academic process. That exactly we are having, we are having postgraduate diploma in sustainability science, which recently we have uh, developed into uh, master of arts in sustainability science. Right. Okay. Then, in the case of the vision model, what you know is offering is the customization of existing courses. Done, mm -hmm. but integrating the principles and practice of sustainability and sustainable development in different courses. Yeah. If you look into the past markets of different courses, you will find out one or other is good. We are talking about sustainability, we are talking about sustainable development. So, what I am saying is, mm -hmm. if you are looking, you are following two models and two approaches, what I was talking about that uh, inclusion model and diffusion model, on the other hand, approach of that through awareness, we are trying to make uh, that model of uh, what uh, we are uh, talking about uh, this behavior modification perspective with employment perspective. Okay. This is exactly, uh, you know, we are uh, trying our best uh, uh, to implement uh, this uh, education process. Again, if you look into when we are talking about uh, sustainability from uh, the institutional perspective, you know, two needs to be looked into a course. One is the practices you follow as an institution. Okay. Is, is we're talking about program, courses, academic discipline. When we talk about the uh, processes, a process we follow, one is very clear program, we have different program that we follow in okay, sir. infusion and diffusion model. Yeah. When we talk about a process and practices we follow, mm -hmm. if you look into uh, our campus development plan, we follow the sustainable practices. Oh, that's why you know greeneries. Greeneries are there. Okay. Water harvesting technology, water treatment plan. Okay. Yeah. And uh, that uh, recently, last two, three years, 
Mm. We are, I mean, uh, using solar energy. Energy, you know, it's very, very so, popular. Yeah, yeah this, this is our initiative. Okay. Right. Mm. This is uh, our commitment. Okay. Right. Then others is, if you look into educational process, mm -hmm. from the last five years, what we are looking, we are pioneering online education. Yeah. We are looking towards paperless education delivery mechanism. Yes, sir. Just interesting. Like, uh, can you tell more about that? Because more online learners, mm -hmm. there are uh, the viewers. There are some questions about uh, what hand up or like uh, online education, especially how you will ensure that availability and accessibility and affordability. Yeah. The, that details, please. Yeah, yeah. When we uh, when we are talking about effective implementation about you know achieving sustainable development, sustainable mm -hmm. uh, development goals. Uh, Basic principle, ignore is following, and uh, others has to follow is, one is in our country like India, mm -hmm. even across the world, yeah, and okay. we are very poor, we have, uh, still we are developing country, we have a number of uh, 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 peoples, okay. they are in that kind of livelihood that we call is hand to mouth, right? Okay. They also need to be given education, mm -hmm. for them, and in general also, when mm -hmm. we are trying to implement something, there should be, Mm -hmm. Availability. Anytime it should be available. Right. Okay. Accessibility. Mm -hmm. If you have the availability, accessibility, if you are not able to give them affordability, who will tag you? Who will follow? Mm -hmm. There is a saying that yes. if you are hunger, no one takes care, uh, take care of, uh, they, do, do, they don't bother about uh, that going to the temple. Right. So they we, don't pray. You if like you are hungry, so in that way, if you have that thing in front of you, if you are not able to provide them the affordability, that is mm -hmm. important. And then, you know, uh, when we talk about achieving sustainability, giving higher education, all uh, this lifelong learning, the concept, we are following all these things. If you are not given that any time, mm -hmm. today's information communication technology is, so, so our online approach, Right. Mm -hmm. Online education approach. It may be online question paper. This is the effectiveness. Yes, sir. Then the fees we are taking mm -hmm. very highly affordable. You cannot compare with others. These ours are highly affordable. And the basket of programs. So this is exactly. Sir, yeah. uh, just I like to know uh -huh. this uh, BGD is what is the program fees for our uh, Indian uh, national students. Uh, see, uh, before coming to that, I just want to uh, say something that uh, the major objective of this postgraduate diploma in sustainability science. Now, uh, as I mentioned, uh, what is our international efforts and ignores efforts on sustainability? One of the major that uh, steps uh, internationally we are taking is that. Uh, Across the world, all nations has committed that we have to achieve the 17 sustainable development goals by 2030. So, well, education for an important role. So, mm -hmm. when in the process of implementing those 17 goals to, with 167 targets, capacity building is very much important. Is, um, and uh, anyone can join with the condition where the courses is literally criteria is fulfilled. So the major objective of this postgraduate diploma in sustainability science is to provide to the learners an opportunity to deepen their knowledge and understanding about okay. what we are talking about sustainable development principle of sustainability science. Okay. Great. Then is 
as I uh, mentioned you about, we need to develop capacity building, right? Mm -hmm. That is to expand capacities of the learners on various theoretical and practical aspects of sustainable development. Yes, a sir. person may be expert in any field, mm -hmm. maybe sociologist, maybe computer science engineering, but when you talk about uh, the sustainability, that mm -hmm. the issues, the issues need to be understood from a holistic perspective. True. That is. That through this course, if you are enrolled in this course, you will be able to understand those issues from a holistic perspective. Then, as I told you, that there is a need for mentor development. So, that needs to be uh, developed in a professional way. So, this program will be able to, uh, to develop one uh, that uh, learners into uh, to have uh, that uh, professional knowledge skills in the formulation, implementation, monitoring, uh, monitoring, evaluation of sustainable development projects and program management. We know we have already developed uh, a number of policies and programs, right? Okay. Right, sure. So, uh, if we, uh, you are... Uh, yes. Yeah. Just I like to know, what is the fee structure for uh, Indian national students? If they want to join PGTDS, how much they have to pay? I mean, per year? Yeah, see, uh, PGTDS is offer in two more. One is the ODL, another is ODL. Mm -hmm. When we talk about the ODL, uh, the fee structure is 7,000 rupees for the entire uh, this, uh, okay. program taken, uh, excluding examination fees. When we are, why we are offering this PGTDS into open, uh, this online is, is I told you one is, uh, that reaching to the unrest means beyond our international boundaries okay. in an highly accessible way okay. and by following that a three A's principle okay. so that we can uh, I mean reach to other uh, country also that is the okay. thing then so looking into that uh, the Indian student they will uh, their pre started 7000 okay, uh, for this program mm -hmm. then star country Indian rupees 11,000 right Okay. And for other international students, it is dollar four hundred twenty-five, right? For the, I mean, US dollar. US dollar four hundred twenty-five. This is the fee structure. Fee structure. And just I mean, I like to know uh -huh. this simple senses. What are the courses? You how like uh -huh. the courses and the structures? Uh -huh. How many credits? Can you cover those details? Yeah. You? See, uh, when uh, we are talking about this course on sustainable science. What is sustainable science? Mm -hmm. I, I talk about the you know, concept of sustainable, sustainable development. Sustainable these sciences, you know, uh, to understand Uh, the seven theory course, uh, seven theory course in a that academic framework, so that when we talk about as I told about nature society interaction, mm -hmm. when nature is one component, right? Okay. What we run is as a society we okay. depend on the nature mm -hmm. for resources. That medium is through what okay. economics. Yes. Right. So in this course, mm -hmm. course number one that will be on sustainable science, the basic. Fundamental principle influence 
the way of resources we consume. Right. That is why we need to understand the sustainability from sociocultural system perspective. Right. Great. Then we need to understand the ecology, uh, that economics from its ecological point of view. Mm -hmm. Which is a medium where nature society interaction is to be low. Then we know what is the society uh, we are, I mean, uh, that human civilization is growing and the nature society and nature society interaction is governed by some institution or some governance policies. In modern world, we use governance policy, but in this time, the traditional informal society was there. So that needs to be looked from this institution governance policies point of view. Then we have a number of strategies and the models that need to be re looked and some approach needs to be identified, right? Great. So there are a number of challenges mm -hmm. when we are trying to implement uh, the sustainable development goals and the sustainable development process. So that. provide that features. Can you cover those details? Yeah, yeah. Uh, see, uh, before coming into the learning management system, mm -hmm. I would like to show, uh, tell to the learners about assessment method. Available here. Then, mm -hmm. there also we you will see the our workflow that your workflow there. Mm -hmm. You have to propose. You have to send the pro, upload the proposal. Mm -hmm. The proposal uh, has to be uh, evaluated by a committee. Okay. Then the feedback, whatever approved, non approved, and feedback will be sent by you. Take okay. mm -hmm. it. After getting the approval, only you can submit the full project. Report. Full project. Everything is purely online. So the I mean just it's a simple question for uh, to know the viewers. Mm -hmm. Can the student can directly submit the pro project work without proposal? No, no, no. There is that side. Okay? Yeah. That's it. Proposal first. You have to submit a proposal. Proposal after you upload a proposal, it will go to the committee or evaluator. Evaluator will approve or give feedback. Right, or we would uh, would give some comment whether it uh, it is uh, needs to be improved or not. Right. So many checkpoints, so many evaluations. Yeah, yeah, that that's great. Be, uh, that's a great topic, no? Yeah, yeah. So, yes, sir. Just uh, what are the scope? Can you cover a little bit? Yes, of uh, I uh, mentioned about uh, main for development capacity uh, capacity uh, building is important uh, when we talk about sustainability. Mm -hmm. Right. Just by 2030. Right. Okay. So every organization is looking uh, for uh, the professional expert or those who have understanding in this area of sustainability, sustainability science. In fact, uh, this discipline sustainability science is 
will acknowledge a poster world as one of the tools to achieve sustainable development goals by 2030. So uh, this shows that uh, after, I mean, uh, successfully completion is, I told you about theory courses about the project, yes, yes. a student, they will be well equipped as professionals, snap the expert, then if you are able to understand those how to develop the proposal proposal what is your understanding the holistic approach of what is now the issues of sustainability sustainable development in yourself become an expert then you will become a sustainable entities right okay. and uh, uh, the another scope is those who are looking for higher education mm -hmm. now if you look into any fellowship and any uh, look into any of the core research area then there is a need for multidisciplinary approach of research and the world is going towards that direction. Yeah, that when we talk about multidisciplinary research, and, uh, it's uh, basically most of the uh, most of the uh, core area is looking towards sustainable development or sustainability. So these uh, courses will help you uh, to uh, go uh, to uh, look into that multidisciplinary uh, to work in multidisciplinary uh, theme or to work in the area of uh, Research area of multidisciplinary. In fact, a few of our that past student they already got because of uh, I mean through those the knowledge they earn are uh, in busy days they are able to uh, get international fellowship and okay well, well, they have some basic degree but okay. this they themselves say sir because of this degree we are able to conceptualize the thing this help us to uh, get those fellowship. Uh, one of our students now, uh, he's working in United Nations University. He okay. uh, often says, sir, because of this, my understanding, he's an economist. He's from a premier institute. He said, because of that, I'm able to get. Because Good. my understanding as an economic mm -hmm. was entirely different. Okay. But after uh, getting this uh, degree, postgraduate diploma in sustainable science degree, my understanding then the way of approach of developing research because you know when we apply for a fellowship there is a rigorous i mean uh, continuity and, uh, process yes. uh, is there so you have to develop it. Uh, that, that kind of understanding that kind of knowledge he earned help him to get that in fact if you look into major university across the world uh, premier institute they have full place discipline sustainable science so those who are looking for higher degree that will help them and uh, even if you look into uh, in the field of journalism development practitioners no this course will help them uh, and uh, and have uh, uh, understanding clear understanding in the field of multidisciplinary area of uh, issues of sustainability so uh, now like uh, just i mean we will cover about uh, the online team uh, online or teaching and learning process And finally, they will uh, fill up their uh, applications and they will upload their barata. So the, that details will be the and then the Igno provides a learning management system that you uh, uh like that it is available in you know online yes, uh, uh, so I, uh, since i'm a teacher when you are uh, handling i mean we it's like us as we know uh, that the government No online dot ac dot in.
approach you follow? That purpose, we are providing learning management system. Okay. Which is starting from mm -hmm. lms.eonline.ac.in. Mm -hmm. From that page, Approaches uh, including like uh, uh, assessment with some uh, courses which has the piece, mm -hmm. some courses it has that like learner has to download that assignment and they have to mm -hmm. uh, write and uh, own handwritten and upload that assignment that it also. Yeah. That is evaluated by mm -hmm. our uh, respective uh, evaluators, mm -hmm. our student evaluation divisions. Mm -hmm. They have alerted some respected evaluators uh, through the region centers. There are academic counselors also there. They will evaluate, they will put on the schools either on uh, program coordinator mm -hmm. or uh, respective materials to put here, and we have video by recorded video by expert. Is there any continuous? Uh, I mean, what we can say that uh, the classes is there or no? or evaluation is the assignment evaluation group discussion is over there and if you talk about time and examination is also purely online what about certification okay okay before uh, coming, uh, coming to the certification that live session also like doing the some cases you know like watch learners mm -hmm. they may be working under the yeah. their time uh, working on the night shift and days they are not able to attend that session so okay that video recorded yeah okay oh uh, uh, yes offline it's, it's available in the archive folder okay so that is the online discussion the interaction yes, yes, that's yes. also in addition that's... to the recorded video yes yes, yes. that teleconferencing channel we can say that online uh, discussion or classes will also be available here yes, yes. right that is uh, and then viewers we have to understand the unique uh, that, uh, that uh, approach we follow in online teaching learning process who is very different mm -hmm. from others and we will be happy to know that uh, because of ignores efforts and uh, when ignores the facts of implementing in this and uh, today online education play an important role uh, across the world, right? Correct, correct. Yeah, that is what to ignore hard work during the last two three decades. Now, other university mm -hmm. is, uh, I mean, following our path. Yes. Even government of India is following our recognizing, path. acknowledging, and in NEP, we look into national education policy, then online, uh, that uh, teaching True. learning process has become the core component. So, True. this is what IGNO is doing. That is what India is doing. That is like that. So, in flexibility learning, we've already done it, but that is the IGNO is the pioneer. That way, we are going towards the virtual university. <laughs> okay, sir. So, you are asking about examinations. So yeah. once like you know, I mean uh, the, I mean uh, during that uh, I mean uh, sessions, yeah. like you know, conduct the examinations uh, during uh, uh, December session. Yeah, 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 two yeah. sessions. Two sessions. Two sessions. Okay. December session and as well as June. Okay. So what's happened? Uh, like the uh, December examination is two months in advance. Mm. There will be a link of uh, you know will give the announcement 
learners Based upon that, uh, course code will be okay. So, if it is elective, then they have to choose, uh, choose the particular elective course. Then, accordingly, they have to make the fees. Okay. For appearing examinations, one paper, mm -hmm. like it's a 250 rupees. Yeah, that's okay. So, as of now, like that, there is no fees difference between on, like, online mode and ODL mode. Yeah, say so, uh, uh, that viewers, you have to understand one thing when we talk about uh, uh, program fee, the program fee is different than examination fees. Yes. yes. So you have to pay this new examination fee when you appear for examination, right? Yeah. And other flexibility is, you know, we have for a postgraduate diploma, like in this PGD SS, you have a minimum one year means you can complete uh, straight one year or flexibility up to three years. So one can complete any time, right? Yes. Okay. Within these three years, yes, yes. that means after completion of one year, you can take only three or four courses then really? remaining in the next examination. Correct. Right. Correct. So we conduct two uh, examination in a year. Yes. Yeah, that is. That is the December session and as well as June. Okay. June session. Uh, like, but at the current moment, due to like the you know, lockdown, there are few delays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For it is a, across not only you know it is uh, yes, 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 across yes. even in uh, any of the system education system even uh, other department activities in other yes, departments. Yes, yes. For this uh, PGDS examination also like online examination it's to, to be announced on uh, next week. Yeah. Uh, July the examination will be conducted uh -huh. conducted for online uh, learners. Ne, uh, I think now, now like we covered uh, examinations and evaluations also. Apart from that, would you like to, sir, uh, would you like to convey to the learners anything? Learners, uh, now admission is open for uh, this uh, July 2022 session. So we increase uh, you to look into our this online uh, portal uh, of our Ignos initiative of online education, and you can choose any of the program you are interested. And as far as PCDS is, is concerned, you know, uh, that admission is already open. And uh, I increase those uh, who are eligible, means graduate in any discipline, to apply this course. And uh, you have uh, that, that this opportunity of learning anywhere by anybody, anyone with highly affordable that fees then become a ambassador or expert in sustainable development let us make a, a different world let us be part of ignos commitment on so, sustainability education and uh, for sustainable plan thank okay. you okay thanks once again uh, to uh, i mean i congratulate uh, all the uh, viewers and the learners who are planning to join an online program now the window is open. There are 36 online programs. Kindly visit our you know, website and see that you know homepage itself that uh, registration window is available. And uh, either you, know, you can choose online mode or ODL mode depends on your requirements. We have covered about online programming about uh, sustainability sciences, postgraduate uh, diploma, uh, sustainability sciences, BGDSS. And uh, keep in touch with us, you know, our live Facebook sessions. Continuously, we will update more and more uh, about the progress details. Uh, thank you to all the viewers, and uh, we will meet you on next sessions. Thanks, sir. Thank you. 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 Thank